Hello, my homies. Welcome to another video. Happy summer. It is right now, July 4th. I'm going to a pool party, and I thought it's such a good time to try out a new foundation. I don't know. I just got it from Amazon, and I can't help but want to try it. We are going to try it out together. First off, hi, I'm Laura. Thank you so much for pressing play. Um, we are going to try out the new e.l.f. Soft Glam Foundation. I don't know why. I'm not a foundation girl, but I saw people loving this, so I needed to try it. I don't know if this is even my color. I should have got a few, but this is light cool because I'm a little on the red pinky side today, or lately, and we're gonna go for it. We're gonna try this out. So my skin is prepped, ready to go. I am going to a pool party and I'm definitely gonna swim, but I don't know if I'm gonna go under, so I still wanna look pretty glammed up, like a little bit. So I'm gonna start with my e.l.f. Woe Glow. This is just gonna go underneath. This is a sunscreen. Obviously I need a sunscreen if I'm gonna be out in the sun. So I'm gonna pop this all over. Um, I hope you're having a good day. I hope you're gonna do something super fun for the 4th of July, maybe see some fireworks, maybe eat a hot dog or a veggie burger or slather mustard and ketchup on everything and enjoy life because why not? Why not? Our world is crazy. We might as well enjoy our days off, right? Okay. We're going in. We're going to try this foundation. I'm very glowy, obviously. This is the Woe Glow. Um, so we'll see. We'll see how these two actually mesh together. So this is the Soft Glam Satin Foundation. It has a medium, buildable, long-lasting coverage. It has 1% of hydrating hibiscus complex. All right. Get buildable, just right coverage, and a long wearing satin finish with this hydrating foundation using a brush or a sponge. So we're gonna do one side with a sponge and one side with a brush. How does that sound? So I'm gonna pop this on. Ooh, this might be my color. This might work. I feel like I always kind of run away. Oh yeah, run away from cool, but like I wanna pretend like I'm a neutral girl, but I don't know. I feel like I can be more of a cool cool tone because I have red undertone or pink undertone. Anyway. Um, okay. First impressions. It's blending. It is very blendable. It's definitely not full coverage, which I like. It feels nice. We'll see. I'm gonna add a little more. Let's see. Okay, so when you're using a sponge, just know that the sponge soaks up product. Oh, it is pretty. It soaks up product, so if you have, if you want that full coverage, a sponge, you're, you're gonna have to use more product, if that makes sense, so. But let's look at the comparison. This is no makeup. This is makeup. Hmm. No foundation. Foundation. I don't hate it. It actually feels really nice on the skin too. Like it is soft. So that's with a sponge. <laughs> let's use a brush now. Did I even put a foundation? I did, I did. All right, so I'm gonna do the same thing, just the other side with a brush. I'm gonna use this brush from e.l.f., one of my faves. It's their Complexion Duo brush. So we'll use this and see how it goes. This is so easy to blend, that's a plus. Melting right into the skin. I kind of sometimes avoid the nose, but we're gonna use 
a little bit on the nose. All right, um, what do you think? I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna do another layer. So it's even. I love the packaging. I love the gold. Like how pretty is that? Elf. This was also $8, I just want you to know. $8 for a beautiful foundation so far. And can you even, like why would you spend money on anything else if this works for you? All right, we'll get down the neck. All right, sponge. Brush. Looks pretty much the same. So it's kind of like whatever floats your boat. But I'm gonna go in with my sponge all over here just to kind of make everything even and soak up any product that is lingering. Hmm. All right. I'm gonna do the rest of my face. I'm gonna zoom through it when I edit, and then I'll give you my final thoughts. Final thoughts, I think it's beautiful. I am looking at it up close and it is exactly what it says. It is soft, it is blended in, it's definitely buildable. I have to get some bronzer and put that all over my chest and my shoulders, but that's because I used my bronzer a little heavy handed, but it looks so good. Here, it's a little close, you can see. Oh my gosh, I love this. I I love this. I'm gonna keep using it. And I feel like I'm gonna use this kind of like every day if I need, or if I have like an event and I don't wanna wear a lot of makeup, but I do want to cover up and look a little bit more put together and glamorous. This, Elf did it again. Elf is so good. <sighs> Anyway, thanks for tuning in. I hope you liked this video. I will link this below. Um, this is light cool, this color. There's plenty of colors and I'm obsessed. I will talk to you later. Love you.